right. for sure. Um, and you're certainly not lacking for top play with Mist and Ryuga either. No, no, and they're, they're both super good players in their respective. So um, we'll see how this flushes out. I'm very excited to see this. I hope you guys are all having fun. We're getting Absolutely. right into Grand Finals without wasting another moment. Let's hit it. Smashville, let's go. Here we uh, start it out. And, uh, Both early. members yeah, of Red Team immediately flying in. Yeah. Trying to set the tone with an aggressive pace early on. But you know what? That might be the uh, the adjustment they make here. That might just be out the gate. They know what they have to do is uh, obviously 6 w is very aggressive. Um, Dark Shad, you know, could be, can be aggressive. So I think maybe they're, they're going to test the waters and see. Does an aggressive gameplay, does an aggressive style uh, put Blue Team on the edge? Yep. So let's see. Mysterica oh. putting the pressure on uh, 6WX though. I think Darkshad read that Ryuga was going to interrupt that, and so he just stopped up and was like, I'll just back air everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Worth it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, take the damage, man. That's a powerful yeah. back air. But you saw, I like the patience I just saw from Darkshad, but he quite. wanted the, yeah, he wanted the forward zone. Or it's the down true. Zone. The, the down air is down true air, there, yeah. but if you DI appropriately, then you won't actually get the spike hitbox. No, and Ryuga's very familiar with that, of course. Um, yeah. So it'd be something that he gets oh, caught with that tech it. thing. Caught both of them, nice. Yeah. Riga did opt to just go to the core and most familiar character. Okay. Almost killed 6WX by just countering the spin dash. Yeah, and that could be a oh, uh, game stopper. Sour spot Shoryu just takes 6WX's stock. Unfortunate. Bats within, but she tried. Oh, I wanted the platform, but just had enough of a resource to get back to stage. Yep. That was uh, kind of scary from uh, Mysterica. Definitely. Okay, Strong? gets there with the yeah. hard jab. Yeah, well, okay. All that ending lag from Bayonetta dropping those afterburner kicks and witch twists. That's what you want to do against Bayonetta. And yep. uh, I think a lot of people overlook that fact, but that's that's her weak, that's her disadvantage, you know? You gotta so, be aware of that. Definitely. Ryuga and Mist need to close the stock on Dark Jet. You yes. can't let a Rage Ryu stick around. Because in Winners Finals, we saw that one of the big things about this was 6WX uh, stock tanking and, and Ryu losing his stocks. But actually, yeah. Dark Shad has now kind of reversed that role. You know, so and that's what we saw before Winners Finals. I think Tyroy and Big Mac kind of knew what they what they needed to do. That may be because they have more Ryu experience. Maybe not. I'm not really sure. But um, you kind of want to focus on taking Ryu stocks because uh -huh. when he's off stage, he's a little bit vulnerable. Um, and you don't want him to have the, that rage to sit on. No, he's very, he, he, he'll gladly take all that rage if he can get it. They have been comboing 6WX well, though. Yeah, no, that's a big factor. And honestly, the 6WX ability Ooh. to be that support role and just kind of play the instigator, you want to take that away from him. Tech in place, sure, you takes Ryuga's stock, but then Mist is able to ladder 6WX off. Yeah, and that's big, right? We talked about how hard it is for 6WX to get out of those ladders, so yep. we're going to need to see a plethora of those if uh, Mysterica and Ryu maybe want to run this back. Definitely. All right, so Riga's done a good job controlling space with Corrin too. That dragon lunge that you mentioned disrupting things pretty well. Yep, we saw it there. Tilt. It's catching kind of Sonic's approach right there. Yeah, kind of what we want to see. Oh, it's gonna be big. He's gonna get him in the corner. He's in another catch. He's gonna get out. Oh, footstool. Okay. Oh, I don't think he meant that, but Chad just ran out there with the raw down air and was like, "This might spike." I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna we'll try see what it. happens. Yeah, right. That so he he just nair dared and then went for another dare. That second one may have killed if it was if the first dare was actually a nair instead. Okay, but switch up the combo a little bit. Yeah. And why There's, do you think that is? Uh, well, the second nair would have popped him up a little bit higher, and okay. then it auto, also auto cancels earlier. So then you're able to jump and get a little bit wow. more height before you get the down air. I am remembering that you main Ryu, so that's yeah. a big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you you got to know that. I've studied plenty of Dark Shad. I wouldn't have known that. <laughs> yeah, studied plenty of Dark Shad to try to learn my character a little nice. bit better. Okay, great back air. Yep, the classic. Yeah. Going to find it. But uh, Dark Shad just got to... Now he's got to find the stage. It's going to be tough. He's, yeah, but that focus punch coming in big. There's another one. Of course, Mysterica trying to find the Wishers combo. Here. Yeah. Not going to get it, though. And once again, still at 150%. With two stocks left. He is just above the rest right now. Man, and that's just it right there. CWX just sitting there with the spin dash charge, trying to bait an approach option. Yep. That's, uh, that's focus. the focus. Oh, okay. Oh, Ryuga did a great job drifting outside of the focus range, so Dark Shed was tempted to throw out the punch and then just got him with the up air. Yep. Smart stuff from Ryuga playing around that, and that's kind of what you have to do against a good Ryu. Definitely. Kind of keep out of range and use your disjoints, you know, your, your best ability. But, uh,. Now it's uh, full stocks apiece, but high Ooh, percents okay. for Team Red. Yeah. And Ryuga barely living on his last leg here. Mist also may have died there if Mist hadn't done a, a bat within right as the, the up tilt transition to the Nair. Yeah, but that could turn race. into Nair chains too. Yep. Okay, right. I assure you, that's not, not quite. He's got no rage anymore. So. Yeah. 
Plus, I don't know if um, Good if Jiga fell off stage or not, but he just, um, might not have been grounded. Yeah. And then he times the ledge jump from Corrin and just eats it with a hard jab. Jeez. Is that it? Yep. Yeah. Not enough height. No juice left there. I think Mist wanted to kind of creep over the edge before she dropped out into down air. Feel it, but try to mix it up a little bit. Yeah, catch him off guard. You don't sure. want, yeah, you don't want Ryu because he's gonna try to up tilt you out of it. Yeah, it's usually what he tries to do. Yeah, but uh, yeah, not, don't want to give him that opportunity. You don't really want to give Ryu an opportunity to up tilt ever. <laughs> I, I agree, <laughs> but on the ledge, it's, it's particularly bad. <laughs> For sure, <laughs> just kind of puts up a wall. Now you get to find your way around you it. Or get dunked. That's right. <laughs> so you got to think about both those things. But uh, Dark Shed and Six WX. Um, closing it out. So they're up one game, and now they only need two games to win. And, of course, Ryuga and Mysterica need six. I so thought that was close enough that I don't think Ryuga should switch characters. Did he switch? I don't think. I, I didn't hear him. I hear I, no, it. I heard Ike. So I he, mean, it's worth a try. Yeah. I sure. feel like it's worth a try. And it worked out so well against Big Mac and Tyroy. Yeah, like, they did. won, like, five – they won literally five straight games with that composition. Yeah. After did. losing. Like, it worked out so well. So I think, you know, why not give it a shot? So yeah, it's just going to be a little bit on Mist to interrupt yeah. some of these long drawn out punishes that Ryu gets on Ike. Yeah, because he's a heavy, he's a big guy, you know, like those, those comments work so well on him. Doesn't it. really have any get off me options. Yeah. He just kind of gets caught. So, yeah, big, 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 uh, big. Ah, I can't speak. It'd be important for Mysterica definitely to, to watch the back. For sure. That was a lot happening off stage. <laughs> it's hard to even follow all of it. Down throw from 6WX. Chad just opts to. Sure you anyway. Yeah, big uh, bit of a cluster there. Yeah. Chad's right. making really good use of his anti-air. Oh no! Oh, Ryuga tried to use the get-up attack to interrupt it, and just ended up also eating a sure you. Yeah, a little bit of invincibility frames there from the sure you. Yeah. Had to get through with that. Like you said, one, two, four. Mm -hmm. Not gonna do it. Up throw. Oh, he had the patience, but oh, oh geez. He canceled it a little bit early and just ate that forward smash from Miss. Yeah. Because Ryuga baited him. He he drifted out, so Darkseid was like, okay, I'm safe now. He's yeah. out of range. And then Mist was like, no. I didn't even see Mysterica there because I was like, yo, <laughs> you you're just waiting for the up air. Yeah. But, okay, Mysterica, you got it. Fine. Okay, that's, that's good. <laughs> Ryuga's, Ryuga's living still. And All he right. just took a stock from 6WX, so the Ike paying off so far. Yeah, it's looking like it's working. Oh, oh. okay. 6WX wanted a Shoryu out of the grab. Yep. And instead he got a test attack. Yeah, it's hard, though, when uh, everyone's in the corner. There's so much going on, but they will find it one way or the other, and that is oh, Ike's first Darkside stop. Darkseid used both of his jumps. Okay, that was a little bit dangerous. Yeah, we've seen, uh, you know, I feel like Darkseid's been a little ambitious offstage. Yeah, he has. You know? It's hard to be ambitious offstage against Bayo, too. Okay. Yeah. Which time? Um, he'll take the damage Ryuga for sure. Ryuga did a great job just grabbing 6WX and holding in there so he couldn't interrupt any of the witch type punishes. Yeah, it's something, something you want to do. You want to keep those witch twist combos going as long as you can. Great, just great awareness once again. Oh. Up um, tilt to jumping B reverse Shoryu on his partner. Okay, there's the jumping Shoryu on Mist though. Yep. Gonna work good out. Oh, not gonna kill though. Six Ryu's. WX doing a good job defending Dark Shed. Oh, I no. was. So Ryu can do neutral get up to Shoryu, and there's only two frames of vulnerability on it if you buffer it. And I thought he was gonna do it there because Six WX had someone grabbed, but he just decided to jump up instead. Yeah, and just kind of throwing out a huge hitbox like that to just cover those options, man. Yeah. Just kind of got choked out a little bit there. 6WX just got laddered off the top, too. Ryuga holding on to two stocks. Yeah, this is big, and this is kind of how it, it was supposed to go to plan, right? We, we, yeah. we were talking about how Ryuga needs the stock take, man. He needs to keep on the hold on to those stocks. But he's also been kind of kill security, so he's kind of been playing multiple roles here. Definitely. You know, been very versatile. All right, here comes Mysterica, but 6WX breaking up the action. All right. Oh, my God. Hard That's going to kill. Yep. Hard up tilt kills about 125 or so. Wow. There you go. Not what he would have been expecting, but even earlier on, on Dark Shed. It's also a crazy good uh, anti-air kill option at high percents because Ryu's torso up is all intangible. Mm -hmm. So he can kind of eat aerials with it the same way that, like, a Mario or a Game & Watch Up Smash does. Very smart. So that was a good option for him. Oh, he gets the up air pulled out. Oh, my oh, God. Six wow. WX. That's disgusting. The wow. patience from this man. Wow, that he, was pretty. Yeah, that was uh, that looked good, and that's just the. Uh, so you? Oh, misses it. Good tech from uh, Ryuga. Oh, and the he wanted <laughs> the spring, but not gonna kill though. Dark Shadow wasn't quite paying attention to the quick draw. That yeah. just eats it for no real reason. Oh, and there's a okay, spring instead. Spring. It's yep. Yep. And that is the once you have Ike alone and have him off stage, like he can get him so easily by Sonic. Oh yeah. And that was like wow. I was like Mysterica and 
Riga are going to take game number two. They're looking good. They're up. And then yep. all of a sudden, 6WX just breaks out the moves. Yeah. That was absolutely disgusting. Break dancing on them. Yeah, literally. <laughs> um, that was quite the setup, man. It was It was yeah. very Reminding us all that he's 6WX. Yeah. You know? Well, that's the benefit of playing in a more aggressive Sonic. You, you know all the defensive options people are going to offer for as soon as you start to put pressure on them. And so you can just drop down, wait a little bit, and then extend your punish even further. Mm -hmm. So it gets it gets real mileage. Yeah. Well, that was impressive. Now that's going to put Ryuka and Mystica in the hole 2-0 now. Yeah, their and backs are up against the wall. Yeah, really. And then 6WX and Dark Shadow are probably feeling all the momentum in the world right now yeah. after that. And we've seen 6WX kind of save the day numerous times. They have. You know? I'm curious because I don't know. 6WX and Dark Shad to this point have dropped one game. I... I believe it. They dropped one game to Ling Ling and Colonies. Wow. And that's it. I believe it, man. Like yeah. you said, just the amazing talent that comes together. It just, sure. it just flushes out. It works out. So here we go into game number three. Can Ryuka and Mysterica get, their, get from uh, up off the wall here? Man, they're down 2-0. Got to get the reset. They need to wait six in a row. Mm -hmm. Can't take a loss. Uh, this is quite the challenge, man. Oh, my God. Dark Push Shed. Dunk, yeah. Yeah, try for Ryuga. it. Reacting appropriately to not up dive immediately, that. but yeah. if he would have hesitated for a moment, he was gone. Yep. And Ryuga's uh, up B is not very good. Like, yeah. It's not the it's not the most rangeful recovery move. So it's yeah. It's not, and it's also vulnerable on Corrin's head when Corrin's going yes, up. Yes, sir. So it can be punished. Yes. There's to show you, Corrin's gone already. Ryuga yep. needs to to hold on to stocks in this kind of a team composition too. So that's rough. Yeah, and that's what Ike was able to do a little bit better of. But it, it, it didn't seem to help things out. Though. It's interesting that he switched back to Corrin because I thought that the game when he was playing, okay, up he had a shield, um, yeah. was a little bit closer. It was. Uh, yeah, definitely a little closer in game number one. But it, I feel like, you know, they might just feel like, you know yeah. what, we we're gonna we're down against the wall, back yeah. against the wall. We, let's pull out our best. Let's give it our best. For sure. All right. One sometimes games can look close, but you can not still not feel. Very they probably yeah. About they that might the know something we don't. They might say like yeah, we uh, we messed up. Um, okay, so there's an up smash from Mysterica to take uh, Dark Shad's first stock. But well, we've seen that stall from Six WX a lot, like where he, he has the spin dash, he just jumps up, either gets a hit or will land in front of you and kind of just fake you out. Yep. So uh, great mix ups from Six WX, continuing to, to keep it fresh. Right now we see oh. he just turns his attention straight to Ryuga. Wanted the dunk, but not going to get it. Yeah, you know Ryuga, I guess has seen that setup before because he so he di'd out so that he wouldn't die Ooh. from it. And that's smart people too. Would pa panic and di in, I think, and then they get dunked. But yeah, Ryuga showing his quality again. Oh, oh no, six okay. WX. That was dirty. Yep, you've seen those kinds of stocks from six WX in the last couple uh, last couple games here, where he's yeah. just kind of been stealing them. You know, he just like. Ooh, the he patient. drops down from just being laddered and then just runs all the way across the screen and immediately takes someone's stock. His? Like, oh, no, that's it. Oh, he breaks him up. Good stuff from uh, Ryuga. Or I should say Mysterica. Uh-oh. Nope. Tatsu, They're a little too okay. far off. They're fine. But what I feel like is... Um, Even stage control. Oh, the double focus attack. Ooh, he's got him in. He's got him yeah, in a vortex. Good SDI. Yeah, just really getting out of there. That pin almost taking out... Dark Shad stock, but he's a little too low, and that, oh no, and the spring hits his own partner, and they both lose oh, their stocks. That wrong. might be the turnaround that Red Team needs. Possible. Possible Corrin's indeed. Corrin's at 70, so Ryuga's going to have to play really on point from here uh -oh. on out, but it's possible for sure. Yep. Oh, is missed too low? Okay. No, miss is good. Yeah, he got caught, in, a, got caught in the up tilts right on the ledge and had to drop down his only option to get out of that. And, uh, or I should say her. All right. There, okay. <laughs> Opted to not focus attack his partner. I'm sure Six WX is thankful for that. Get out of there, man! Oh man, we're wow! So much ledge Clever play from movement. these two, and the down smash takes it. Yeah, good two frame. Yep. You know, you, you got to realize that she's just gonna try to plank you with the witch twist. Yeah. So uh, take the advantage. Just use a more powerful move and break out of that. Yeah, I think you're already kind of seeing. Okay, is that gonna be it? Yes. That's it. So Six WX and Dark Shad are the outfoxed again doubles champions only dropping one game on their whole run i mean no surprise there they're an excellent team two pgr players that come For together sure. to, uh, to, to showcase their amazing talent and losing only one game against talent like big mac and tyroy and and Hi ryuga and mysterica yeah man that's impressive that's stuff very impressive man.